Hey guys, in this video I'm going to share with you two of my DIY projects for storing baby memorabilia. The first here is just a standard photo album which I decorated with scrapbook paper as well as scrapbooking stickers. On the inside, however, this is where I hot glue gunned a sheet protector so I could safely house my baby's birth recognition. Now I'm going to be showing you how I built my baby's shadow box. This is a nice shadow box I picked up at Michael's Craft Store and I was lucky because it was on a buy one get one free sale. So I have two of them. Now I really like this shadow box because it has great quality but also the backing on this. It's fabric backing so you have the option to either glue in your materials or you can just pin them to the board. The items I'll be using for my shadow box are a newborn diaper as well as I have my baby's umbilical clamp and his umbilical cord stub as well as our ID tags for mom, dad, and baby. I'll also be using a couple pictures that were taken right after he was born. And then the last two items, his baby hat as well as the shirt he wore after he was born. Now choosing how to organize everything in my shadow box, it was really just trial and error, but before I began playing around with the objects, I wanted to get the shirt how I knew I wanted it to look in the shadow box. So here I'm just folding it up nicely and seeing exactly how I want it to look before I begin constructing my box. So once the shirt looks about right, I'll begin to hot glue it together. Now my shirt's in order, now I can begin constructing my box, moving the objects around to see which way I like everything to look. I will also be using some leftover scrapbooking stickers from my photo album project and adding those to my shadow box as well. Once I'm satisfied with the arrangement, I will begin to hot glue everything down in place. And this is how it looks so far. I think it came out really cute. And here is how the shadow box looks completed in its frame. It worked out that I had one last scrapbook sticker which fit perfectly at the bottom of the frame. Now to finish it off, I'm just using some silver alphabet letters to spell out my baby's name along the top of the frame. And there you have it, my complete shadow box, and I absolutely love it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and let me know ways in which you stored your baby's memorabilia. Thanks guys, see you next time.